My name is Connor Mooneyham. I'm 24 years old and I'm from Rockland, California. We began in California when I was about 12 years old. My dad introduced me to the sport. I was a little skeptical at first, just because I, I remember I played pretty much every other sport growing up. My dad said, this is the best sport. This is what you need to play. So I got on the pitch. I remember we got pummeled that game. We didn't even score a single try. And I got in, in the car after the game and my dad was probably really worried. He looked at me and he said, how, how did that feel? I remember my body was just buzzing. I was just on fire and I said, that's a great sport. And uh, ever since then, I just kind of fell in love with the game. Even though those first few years, we lost every single game. I just, I just remember it was something that couldn't replicate in any, in any other sport. My favorite rugby memory would probably have to be last year. 2019, um, winning the national championship with Life University. Um, I just remember feeling great coming off of a, a big break. I was in Argentina for two years, serving a mission for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I remember just coming back and getting the opportunity to step on the field again and really you know, couldn't have asked for anything better, having an undefeated season and winning the national championship. I decided to play rugby in college. I was really um, kind of like a lot of American athletes. I played football in high school, played rugby in high school. And um, I remember Dan Payne had reached out to me to take a look at Life University. Um, he gave me kind of a personalized tour over there and I just fell in love with the program and, and all of its standards. In uh, 2014, um, you know, gave us two really awesome years then. Um, and, and even as a freshman, he got his calling to go on his mission at the end of his sophomore year in January of 2019. And um, after two and a half years, his, his body had, had, you know, matured physically. Um, but I think there was also a lot of um, maturing uh, mentally and emotionally. Is, um, has, has been an awesome contributor for us, um, both on the field, um, and also academically, he's been he's been one of our best students. He's, he's just about a straight A student. So, um, you know, very very good work ethic, very strong work ethic. So, um, anytime you've got the, the natural athleticism that he has combined with the work ethic and the, the mentality, then you're going to get good results. So, Connor's come a long way, um, and uh, yeah, just excited to see how he does at the next level. I'm very excited about joining. You. It's a great opportunity for all athletes in the draft right now, collegiate athletes to just expand their opportunities. When I was 12 years old and we were losing every single game, I, I definitely did not think that my road to uh, playing, playing professional rugby was going to be there. But as I matured and I, I felt like um, my skills were, were getting better and I got reached out by, as I said before, Dan Payne, I really realized that my opportunities at Rome.